today on EL Now. Ebony Live TV and Africa International Film Festival set to partner for 2014 AFRIF. In response to fast rising singer Seon's accusations, pop star Wizkid says he charges 10 million naira for collaborations for artists he doesn't love. Does Weezy have love for Shay Shay? He features her in new song titled Crazy. Still on new stuff, Olamide, M.I. and Rymo set date for album release. And ace hip hop artist and entrepreneur Lynx unleashes a video for his hit single, Leave Story. Also on the show tonight, we bring you Friday Mystery Celeb Interview. Bask in it, it's EL Now. If you left work or school today in a hurry because you're caught up in the Friday fever, if you did a shoddy walk in school or at the office today because of the Friday excitement, raise your glass. Ching ching. Yes, so sorry. Ah, ah, <laughs> oh, sorry, ah, sorry. Ah, sorry. I can't. You left me hanging. <laughs> I wasn't looking. Oh, hi. Anyway, it's fine. It's fine. But anyway, guys, that was Big Brother Ekeng Bassi on the show tonight, checking up on his band. And I'm Ade Laoye, who doesn't care if you left your work undone as long as you are here with me to rock and roll the way we do it every Friday evening here on EL Now. Okay, I'm lying. I care about you guys going back to meet a pile of undone or poorly done tasks on Monday morning just because you got infected by the Friday fever. So stop it. Did I hear anyone say yes, mom? All right, let's take a moment to check out EL Now News. Joyous weekend, EL Now family. My name is Choma Akbota. Desmond Elliott. Monio Boli. Viola Shalanke. Jeff Gezu. Gideon OKK. And what do they all have in common? It's the 2014 African International Film Festival, AFRIF. And this year's fourth edition will see a collaboration between AFRIF and Africa's first global black entertainment channel, Ebony Life TV. EOL reports Arit Okpo asks the CEOs of both enterprises what we can expect from this blossoming partnership. Well, I'm quite excited about what's about to happen. Yes. Um, we haven't worked together before, mm -hmm. so we're quite excited about the fact that, you know, film festivals are so important about growing the, this particular industry. Yes. And, you know, we'd like to partner with the African International Film Festival yes. to see how we can use our platforms mm -hmm. to help engage audiences and to help encourage and to, and, and, and to play our role in building, you know, this particular festival. Um, and you know, it's 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 most respected across the continent. Yes. And um, we're happy to be partnering for the first time. I am super excited with the partnership. I mean, who best to rub minds with both studios? Um, they're looking to come into Africa to understand the market, mm -hmm. and it's great. I've had interviews with them, but with more it would make more sense. It would make more sense to them because she understands more about the studios and then, you know, there's just so much. With an anticipated star-studded lineup, this year is brimming with guest lectures, training workshops, film screening, and a festival awards gala amongst other fun activities. The 2014 African International Film Festival kicks off from the 9th to the 16th of November. <laughs> And the drama between superstar Wizkid and fast rising baseline music's first lady Seon continues as Wizkid responds to Seon's accusations. Earlier in the week, Seon insinuated that Wizkid had not only charged her 1.5 million naira for featuring in her song Boogie Down, as against Wizkid's claim that he doesn't charge for collabos, but he also didn't help promote the song. Now Wizkid reveals that he actually does charge a whopping 10 million naira for collabos, but doesn't charge nothing for artists he loves. Wizkid adds that he is responsible for making Seon's Boogie Down a hit, according to the net.ng. Still on WizKid and Collabos, we can't help but wonder how much love the Afrobeat superstar has for Afropop and R&B singer Shay Shay, with whom he teamed up in a new song titled Crazy. The track was produced by Ace Music producer Legendary Beat. And we can look out for more new music as three Nigerian music heavyweights, ace indigenous rapper Olamide, celebrated Afrobeat singer Brymo, and renowned rapper M.I. announced dates for the release of their new album. Olamide's fourth studio album titled Street OT is expected to drop on the 14th of November. M.I.'s new album is likely to drop on the 30th of October, while Brymo's fourth album titled Tabula Rasa is expected to hit the streets on the same day. And Ace 
Mr. Loft music artist Lynx drops the video to his hit single, Leaf Story. Directed by video director of the moment Clarence Peters, the video is laden with energetic shocky dancers including Lynx himself taking over the streets of Lagos. You're armed with the latest gist. For more, check out ebonylivetv.com slash el now. It's exciting. So, any surprises for us, Ekeng? Okay, you know what? Forget I asked, now I've reminded him and giving him ideas. Anyway, on my side, no surprises. Up next after the break, an exciting interview with an exciting celebrity. And after that, Tosi brings us this week's offering on Please Don't Stop the Music. This is EL Now. <laughs> Thank you.